What's up, Sauce Squad? So today's video um, is going to be a very different video. Basically, we're going to be doing a lot of different videos in this video. We went to our Instagram and asked you guys to send us some video ideas, and um, these were it. Right now, we're just sitting right here because uh, you guys, you guys suggested a pillow fight. <laughs> You cannot keep cheating. I win. Two, one, go. <laughs> I like it first. Ow. Two. Alright guys, I'm gonna show you my makeup routine. Hey guys. You guys know, it's Sav. I'm gonna show you. <laughs> I never referred to myself as Sav. That was so weird. Okay guys, this is my absolute favorite product right now. It's the Junk Elephant Sunshine Drops and they literally just make me look tan and fire and I think you guys all need to use them every day. So this is the foundation that I use and it's Physician's Formula. I got it at Walgreens. I think it's like $7. This is my eyeshadow primer and I've literally used this since probably like 7th grade and it's MAC Painterly. I'll never ever stop using it. This palette I got in a BoxyCharm so I actually don't know the brand of it but I like to use bronzer as eyeshadow so really any bronzer will work. I've been using two products on my brows lately so the first one I use is the Benefit pencil I think and then I also love Selena Gomez's new Rare Beauty eyebrow pencil. Excuse me, I'm gonna hate you about that. <laughs> I, you remember I had to go get it. Oh my God. <laughs> Keep that in there, excuse me, when they you buy that. <laughs> this mascara I actually just got the other day from Target and it's a burgundy mascara. I saw it on TikTok and it's supposedly supposed to make your eyes look greener and I don't really know if it works, but I like it. For concealer, I honestly alternate between a few different ones, but I really do like Born This Way. So I actually never used to wear blush and then I realized how important blush is and I always put it on like the very tip of my nose because then it makes you look super cute and sun-kissed. Guys, I wasn't put on to the Becca highlighter until like very recently, but I know it's an OG and like everyone's been using it forever, but I'm kind of new. This is my setting spray and it's by Too Faced. I usually use the Urban Decay All Nighter Spray, but recently I got this and I love it because it smells like peaches. <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> Hi, can I um order the exact same thing the person in front of me just ordered? Okay, anything else for you? That's all. I feel like she's been around the block. I feel like she's heard that before. We also live in Los Angeles and people do this all the time. That's true. She didn't seem like amazed. She was like, okay. There's only one person in this car, so that's good news unless she bought it for the whole office. Okay, and it's also a girl, so that gives me hope that it's not going to be like a black coffee. Actually, that's not true. Just because a girl, uh, everyone's not like me. I just like my coffee sweet, but I'm just hoping that she also likes her coffee sweet. Oh, I didn't look. Oh my gosh, that was fast. I mean, she probably only got one thing. Yeah. Hi. Okay, Here can we go. actually pay for theirs back there too? Okay. Is it we have enough? Yeah. I say uh Did you wait. say sixteen? Yeah. Okay, yeah. yeah. Alright. Yeah. Thank you. Oh the straw. The straw. Thank you. Thank you. No way. What the heck is that? Uh I'm not impressed with this. <laughs> it's a grande java chip frappuccino with extra mocha drizzle and no whip in a chocolate cake pop. She really likes chocolate. Wow. Okay. But so I guess. do you, though. <laughs> you want a different drink? I wish we could give this to someone, but like literally with COVID, it's just who wants this. All right. So the how many buckets can you make in a minute challenge? Now we got to the court and there was this guy here doing some really weird stuff. But anyways, I tried to attempt to do this. I shot free throws because I'm not a three point shooter. But uh, here we go.
right, you guys, before we do the say it or shot it, we don't have any questions, truths, or anything. Yeah. So we're gonna ask you guys on Instagram. You guys can go follow us to catch the next one. Excuse you. All right, guys, this is gonna be a very quick, quick live. A snappy live. Playing say it or shot it in today's vlog, and we need some truths. So we got the questions. This is how it works. Five different cups. If the person does not want to say their truth, pick a card. And drink what's in the cup. And drink what's in the cup. If you get a two, you got to drink number two and then we eliminate that one. We have soy sauce, hot sauce, pickle juice, creamer. Oh, that's lime juice. Lime that's juice. Okay. And then the special one, this is not that special. We have to lick each other's foot. That's number six. I don't, you, my foot is nice and clean. And what about mine? Your foot's dirty. Cause you didn't take a shower this morning. You don't, yeah, I took a shower last night. I showered last night and I had my feet in socks all day until right now. Okay. And my I just mopped the floors last night. And my feet have been in socks all day. So yours are probably sweaty and stinky. And what are yours? Mine are clean and they smell like peaches. Really? Mm -hmm. How many people have you kissed? I'm ready for this answer as well. You can't count, can you? <laughs> <laughs> you can't count. Here, I'll have the cards. You can go ahead and draw. It's okay. You're really cute, so I, I get it. All the girls want to kiss you, even in elementary. Did you kiss? When was your first kiss? How old were you? Were you a kid? Because no. I never kissed someone when I was a kid. I know people did that. Like when, when, they were like, when did I have my first kiss? Yeah. I was in seventh grade. Oh, okay, me too. Actually, I was in eighth. You lying. No. <laughs> Two? Yeah, what is this? Hot sauce. That's so not fair. Josh likes hot sauce. Oh, my. He's barely drinking any. <laughs> Are you okay? Your water's right there. There's nothing in it, I don't think. When is the last time that we had sex? That's so not fair, babe. You set me up for failure. No, I didn't. I'm not answering that. I can't answer that. Why? That's so personal. Okay, fine. I'm going to answer it. Oh, what you about to tell them? <laughs> Who? <laughs> do they want a date? <laughs> <laughs> I can't answer that. Give me a card. I thought y'all was about to get an inside yeah, on I what will. be going down. <laughs> this one. Ace. Number one. Uh. It's, it's coconut aminos. It's actually not soy sauce. What's coconut aminos? It's like uh, aminos. Oh my god. I don't like this one. Did you drink it? Yeah. I did. Oh, yeah, she baby, did. Not, give me your water. Oh. Please, baby, hurry. You're too oh. slow. What is the most money you've made off of a brand deal? You are so trash. Because I knew you were going to answer. The most money that... I don't think we were allowed to answer that. <laughs> Sorry, baby. <laughs> Here you go. Wait, I could say the most money that I've ever made off a of brand, like one of my brand no, deals. No, it said we. That's terrible. Number five. Oh, that's not bad. It's what not is li it? lime juice. I've never had lime juice a day in my life. It's just sour. Are you okay? It's good, huh? Do the whole thing. Do you like it? Have you ever dreamed about being with another person? I'm trying to think. I'll answer this, but I, I'm just trying to think if I have. That's and you don't think. <laughs> No, I, I haven't, baby. No, not since I've been with you. I'm thinking like since before that. Like I feel like I've dream, had a dream of like dating a celebrity or something. Guys, no, I've never had a dream of being with someone else. I have had dreams about being with you though, and I'm with you, so that's cool. Are you making kids next week? Next week, for exact. No, we aren't making kids next week. I would like to. <laughs> you would. Brand deals that you did not like. Can I answer that? I'm gonna answer this. Okay. I am. We're never gonna work with them ever again. I don't know who's okay. coming out of your mouth. This is a moment of truth, you guys. So back in the day, Josh and I would do brand deals that we weren't like super passionate about, just being 100% transparent. And now we only ever would do something that we love and that we actually use and we would never share anything we don't like with you guys. But we did this one brand deal a long time ago and it was for like cotton tissues. <laughs> and we will never do anything like that again. How many people have you dated? I, don't, I mean, yeah. honestly, no, I haven't even dated that many people. Especially year you had a girlfriend? Yeah. What's her name? <laughs> <laughs> Was she white? Oh, no, white girls. No white One girl. white girl in college. Couple. You've kissed it more than a few white Definitely girls. Definitely not kissed it. Kissed, Maybe. I kissed tell you, it? That's what you just said. No, I said kiss. Oh, no, I'm not cool. You've kissed it more than a few. Cool. You've kissed it more than... Cool. You've Kissed it more than how many people have you dated? Okay, so three maybe, not including you. So three in total. That's a lie. I had at least like twenty boyfriends. Exactly. <laughs> I did not have. Okay, girlfriends. okay, but like boyfriends, you guys. They were like, "We go out with me," and I'm like, "Yeah," uh, and then we dated for like, but we didn't even hang out or anything. It was just we're going out. You want to go out uh, in the hallways in real school? Uh. All right. So the first 
TikTok hack that we are going to do, food hack, is the Skittles one. Skittles wheel. You don't eat this, you don't. but. I've been eating the Skittles though before we made this viral. So you just need three different type of Skittles. So we got the wild berry, tropical, and the originals. So we're basically in art class. That's what's going on. I have to sort them out. Yeah, because I did it the first time. I don't think mine is going to work. Wait, it's going to do something. Okay. I guess I want to do a tiny one on the inside. Mm -hmm. All right, you guys, here we go. We are about to do the final situation here. I'm nervous for the water pour. This is, this is a so moment. So I don't think we need that much water. Yeah, I think it's literally just like a tiny bit. So I'm okay. just gonna do. Okay. All right, let's wait for it. Whoa. It's happening slowly but surely. Okay, okay. Wait, why is mine fire? That's actually, I'm actually, my expectations for this were low. I'm not gonna lie. Really? Wait, mine went off. I told you I needed more water right there. I feel like yours is gonna actually be really fire then, because you're gonna have even more spiralies. <gasps> Driplets. Little here, little here, right there. They're about to mix. They gotta mix in there. Ooh. So I just did every other, like every color, like in a pattern, but Josh did like a few more. So he has like a whole section of orange, a whole section yellow. You got a big hole, baby. What are you gonna do about that? Nothing I can do. All right, so the next thing we're gonna be making is homemade donuts. Now, this is like, I think, takes up to 15 minutes. Yeah, so it's like a quick donut. It's not a full fry situation. First thing we do, one cup of water, three eggs. Three eggs, just straight in? Yeah, straight in. Vanilla extract, I said just to put like, I would say more is better for vanilla extract, but that's just me. That's good. And then, whisk. Okay, can I, can I whisk a little bit? I, I just shouldn't see a full yolk still in here, baby. I wasn't done too hard. Okay, go ahead. I was still whisking, remember? But you're, this is- You this, interrupted this me is, in the middle. This is how you whisk. Guys. They don't have very much patience. Uh -huh. Okay, that's good. Now we can add in the cake mix. We're gonna make it work today. Okay. This smells good. It smells like vanilla. It is vanilla, but. So you could do this with any type of cake mix you wanted. Like if you wanted a chocolate donut, you could do that. Are you going off back there? Okay, so now I'm gonna grease our donut pan. What it's supposed to do is put the batter in a baggie and like cut the corner so that way you can easily distribute it throughout the pan. This is good. It said, she said don't fill it all the way. Yeah, like half. Like a little more, right? All right, guys, now I'm gonna put them in the oven for 10 minutes. She said she was just gonna watch them. She didn't really say, but we're gonna start with 10 and just check on them. So I melted one tablespoon of butter in here. And we have one and a half cup of powdered sugar. No, baby, we're supposed to do it in here, honey. Okay, we must, oh, actually, that looks good. That literally looks like straight up icing. Okay, so then we're gonna separate it into two bowls and do food coloring. So we're gonna make two different colored donuts. Ooh, I love it. It's almost your birthday, you have a cake, okay? These are the cutest little donuts. Bon appetit! Okay guys, we just cooled the donuts and now I'm just gonna frost them. Get the frosting on the top. Cute! All right, you guys, this is the finished product. They're so cute, I'm really proud of us. I am annoyed that they look like blue and pink gender reveal. We definitely did blue and pink, didn't we? Oh, yeah. It's not our gender reveal yet, guys. Yeah. It tastes like a cake. I don't get donut vibes, I get cake. Well, we use cake back. Totally, but I love it. This is actually really good. Mm. Yeah! It's like not too sweet, it's like perfect. Sign me up!
who won that dance battle? You went off, baby. Comment down below. We definitely went in two different genres there. <laughs> okay, guys, we are gonna do the chubby bunny challenge now. So basically, if you don't know what that is, you just go back and forth and put a marshmallow in your mouth each time, and you have to say chubby bunny. Whoever can't say chubby bunny anymore or who can't fit another marshmallow in their mouth loses. I just wanna say, I have a disadvantage. My mouth is so much smaller than yours. Wait, let's measure like this. A what? <laughs> What type of measuring system is that? Oh, I'm not gonna fall off the one. Touch the button. <laughs> Chubby bunny. Mm, good. Yeah, that's what you're supposed to do. I'm pretty tough. Pretty tough. Oh, I'm done for. Touch the button. I thought you could be. Chubby bunny. <laughs> How do you buy it? I can't hit it. Oh, my God. I can't hit it. Oh, my God. 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 How many do you have? Mm-hmm. All right, so the end of the day has come and we have done, I don't know how many videos. This is a long, a long day. I don't know, what time <laughs> is it? It's 9.30 and we is tired. I literally could go to sleep right now. Before we do go, we do have one more video that we wanna do, but someone did request this. It's couple or practical Bible study with an actual scripture or a chapter. That's actually so perfect because there's something that we have been reading lately and we wanna share that with you guys. So there's actually two scriptures. Don't become so well adjusted to your culture that you fit into it without even thinking instead fix your attention on God you'll be changed from the inside out readily recognize what he wants from you and quickly respond to it unlike the culture around you always dragging you down to its level of immaturity God brings the best out of you develops well-formed maturity in you and there's also Matthew 5 15 through 16 this is the English standard version nor do people light a lamp and put it under a basket but on a stand and it gives light to all in the house in the same way let your light shine before others so that they may see your good works and give glory to your father who is in heaven. Guys, Romans 12 2 has been something that's been like instilled in my heart for a really long time and it's just so crazy how that scripture is just creeping up right now when we're in the middle of trying to create something. The revelation that came to me as I was reading it was that we cannot bow to what the culture is you know offering to us. We're supposed to be part of like the redeeming culture not a part of the culture that is out here and if we bow to what the culture is giving us and feeding into our minds and stuff now we're gonna miss out on the supernatural plans that God has for us and I've always known that yo I cannot be out here doing what everybody else doing I can't be rocking with that crowd because I'm gonna miss out on what God has planned for me so, and recently Matthew 5 15 through 16 has came in our life God literally wants you to shine so that you know the world can, and everyone else can see you know your good works I think we were all built and put on this planet to shine to prosper we all have a purpose that's what we've been studying we have something coming mm -hmm. and it's really exciting and and it's something we've never done before. We've done it to like a certain extent, but nothing like what's about to happen. So take that and take and what, what we studying right now. You'll know when you know. All right, Sash Squad, we love you guys. And if you came this far and you are new, thank you. Yeah. You rock. That means you probably should just subscribe and join the Sash Squad, the dopest dope squad, squad on, on the, the internet. internet. We love you guys and we will see you in the next vid. D O. Love you, Sash Squad. Hey girl, I like the way you do that thing. Turn around, slow it down, cause it's just not fair. I gotta be honest, you so so bad. I was looking at myself because I look like Casper this whole time. Really? Yeah, baby. Okay, I love you. You always get the lighting good for you and don't worry about it. I'm gonna do the first. So there's actually, and we're gonna share that with you guys. So I'm gonna do the first. How you doing? <laughs> Tired. Yeah, I am. Uh, there's two different scriptures that's been on our heart late. There's two different scriptures that's been on <laughs> Are you okay, baby? You guys, so there's two different scriptures that have been on our heart lately, and we are gonna read them for you because Josh. He's trying to say that there's been two scriptures on our heart lately, like maybe 10 times. Oh my goodness. I wish I could take my picture today. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> I can't breathe. Okay. Right? Okay, I don't. And also, Josh kept saying that I wasn't getting his balls to him fast enough. But I've never done this in my life. I didn't know what the heck was happening. And I was just scared I was going to get hit with the ball. Okay. You deserve that. <laughs>